November the 1st. We're back at Cage Cove. We're going to do a bit of walking. Should be a blast. We're going to go back across. We're going to pass and hit one of the trails. That's good. What are you going to do, brother? I'm like Lionel Richie. Easy like Sunday morning. Sounds good, brother. That's a pretty good trail. I think it was the Fat Bottom Girls Trail. What do we do if we see a bear? Do we stop, drop, and roll? Is that the rule? A rule of thumb? <laughs> or is that to catch on fire? It's one of the two. I definitely ain't gonna play dead. <laughs> yeah. Okay guys, wet bottom trail and beard cane trail. We'll probably the beard cane trail, 5.7 miles. Beard cane trail. And we're in Cades Cove. Yeah. cold while ago when we got here it said it was what 39 degrees so it's cooler weather looking forward to hiking in some cool weather uh, last night while we were walking we got pretty wet and uh, something hit me uh, started thinking about real heavily is what to do when you get cold so we're gonna practice cold weather hiking because it was pretty intense. It, it turned, it got into the 30s, and my feet were wet. So now I gotta think about what do you do to prevent hypothermia? And I gotta be quick. And if I get hundreds of miles away from home, I gotta be able to get warm quickly. So last night's trip was a blessing. We're gonna jump off the beard cane real quick and go on to the uh, wet bottom trails. We're going to Abraham's Falls Trail right here. It's about a mile away. We're uh, going to the waterfall. We love waterfalls. Beautiful. What are you guys doing today? We're walking to a waterfall. There's no barn we come across on the trail. I don't think I've ever seen this barn before. Pretty cool old structure. Yeah, it's a big barn. Beautiful scenery. We went, we went off the trail a little. Uh, that's part of the adventure of being in a place like Cades Cove. You know, there's so much wildlife, so much stuff to see. Sometimes it's good to get off the beaten path just to just to see what's out here. You know, the adventure of it. Uh, maybe run across a big deer, see a big bear, come across some pretty scenery. Of course, with my Sasquatch nature breaking everything I see, limb-wise and stick-wise, uh, we might be running up more often or attracting or potentially coming in contact with. Pretty scenery. Not sure which trail we're on now. We're uh, they wing it though to see the different sites because it's a good place to come see wildlife in their natural habitat without 
and I really can't say without the fear of being mauled or something. I better get you out here just as quick as we went home, wouldn't it? The live was a to let you be as long as you're with him, buddy. Quit bottom trail. Pretty area out here. Oh, Abraham Falls, 2.5 miles. Over a mile. If you count the circle we did. My Fitbit counter says 57.72, so yeah. And you've made every step I have in this time. Holy smokes. Look at that rushing water. I like meeting up with stick and hiking from time to time because from time to time because he's no jokes about it, he can move. What'd you do the you've done the Disney in 15 minutes to the top, haven't you? That's flipping impressive. So my fellow Disney enthusiast, that's the time to beat. See if you can beat 15 minutes to the top. That's about 10 minutes faster than what I can do it. Uh, nine minutes, maybe. I've never been able to get 15. If you think about minutes, that's a long time, man. Give them something to shoot for anyway. This is where hiking poles come in handy. When you're going down hills, it catches half your weight. Friend of the uh, Abraham's Waterfall. Oh yeah, look at that. That's what it's all about, folks. I mean, that wasn't no Disney hill, but it's a pretty good hill with this climb. And that'll be a good hill coming back up, so. We'll get a flows of stairs today. Having a blast out here today. We picked up probably now maybe three miles so far today. If you count all of our steps, all of our areas we've climbed and hiked to, so it should be I feel like a ten mile pace today because when we get to the waterfall we we'll might have to walk back about another five. Should be 10 plus or better. And that's just starting today, so yay. Well me and Stick made it to what is Abraham's waterfall? Abram's waterfall. Pretty waterfall. Beautiful area. You guys like waterfalls? Beautiful area. It's great before that is camping. Thank you. 
Another real pretty area. This Abrams Waterfall Trail has not disappointed. Beautiful scenery, real pleasant people, and ask for more. We're still on the uh, Abrams Waterfall Trail. This is on the way to it, so I didn't get a chance to get any footage from. Uh, from there because some people were, were filming taking pictures. But see how pretty it is. On the waterfall. But stick waterfall waterfall beautiful scenery out here guys ladies and gentlemen look at the mountains for the backdrop we just hiked Abram's waterfall it was a uh, pretty good little trail we put in about a little bit over nine miles total on that trail. We did a, a little small trail before Avery's Waterfall, and then we walked through the woods, looked for wildlife just to try to see them in their natural habitat. Pretty cool stuff. We have an old cemetery here. We're still in Cades Cove. We're going to pay our respects to this old cemetery out here. Look at that. Alexander Wilson, 1928, or 1828 to 1902. James Parks, 1806 to 1840. Wow. Young, 34. Young man when he died. 